The near commotion attracted our attention Friday morning at the Bafum, a suburb of La Inakra. The gathering ignored the social distancing protocol to state their grievances. Their concerns centered on government's poor poor incentives package following their movement restrictions. Speaking in Ka Anakan, the residents here say they have been neglected in the support package. <laughs> Cecilia Annan is a mother of five and says the hardship is unbearable. Addis lamented over the feeding mechanism. But responding to the allegations, one of those who sell water in the area, known only as Tete, and who declined to be formed, insisted he will only comply with the directive if he received his match bill. However, for Margaret Odoli Odoi, who doubles as a public bathhouse operator, going completely free is impossible due to the internal operation costs. Every week I spend about 30 Ghana cities. Formerly the big bucket is 60. I take 40 because I, they can't come and bath oh, yeah, and go. So I have reduced all of it. But to pay my workers, that's why I didn't give all freely. I reduced it because I too I'll eat. Uh, and I have to call a plumber when there is something wrong with the pipe. She appealed to government to go beyond just the directives and ensure the needs of people are met.